See? Kinsey, all I see is out of my bloody commode. Oops, sorry about that. Let me load up another. I thought you knew what you were doing. I haven't finished your avatar yet. That one's just temporary. Um, I seem to have a distinct lack of arms. Just start moving through the data. I'll sort it out soon. Have you lost your mind? If you're complaining, you big baby. They couldn't just get lost. Oh, there, that's better. Good, because Matt sniffed me out. This is my world to shape as I see fit, not yours. Alright, looks like Matt doesn't want you poking around here. You'll have to work your way through his defenses. Let's take out the firewall first. Firewall? What is it and how will I find it? It blocks us from accessing the Decker's data. You'll know when you see it. going on? He's altering the rules reality there. You'll just have to deal. Some kind of joke. Come on, Kinsey, how do I get out? And ruin it for you? No way, you've got to figure this out on your own. Thanks, Kinsey. Oh, that's it, I quit! Is there a lower difficulty? <laughs> I'm not going to be beaten by some noob you dragged into my world, Kensington. Okay, we're back in business. Now let's take out Matt's antivirus next. Kinsey, I thought we talked about this. But I didn't! I think this is more fitting. Wouldn't you agree? Give me some time, I'll fix it. Hey, I still have my cannon. I've still got it. Connection. He's bombarding us with data. I'll try blocking it. What?
Is this the best you can do, Agent Kensington? Be gone. Okay, the antivirus is almost taken care of. You'll need to destroy the last bit of code. Kinsey, why am I in a tank? Just go with it. I see it, I see it! That's it. I'm gonna enjoy kicking that kid's ass. Oh. That felt good. I see one more wall ahead. It's his internet security protocols. They're blocking access into the main... Yeah, yeah, whatever you say. Oh. Miller doesn't know where to quit. Take this out and we'll open that himself. like the place. It's more up to the Nightblade Season 3 episode Rise of the Cyprian Order. He was with a carver racist plan for it. Wait, you model this shit off of Nightblade? It's an allegory for man's inhumanity to man. It's a shitty vampire show. I don't expect a chuckle fuck like you to appreciate good writing. <laughs> on your company. Why aren't you dying? He's scared. Go to the cathedral and finish him off. You mean where those giant tubes are headed? There can't be a trap or anything. Must be his direct feed into the world. Well, his information flows through. Yeah, that's definitely a trap. Again, with the comforting skills. to laugh when you're hiding like a pussy. Come on out! Gladly. Oh, what the fuck? Don't you get it? I'm God here. That's just fine. In the real world, you're just a bitch with a keyboard. In the real world now, here you cannot beat me. I will see about that. Alright, just don't die until I figure out how to copy his avatar. You can't win when you don't know which way is up. Your controls are backwards. Careful where you're going. Oh shit. I'll kill you one way or another. What are you doing? Get down! You expected to beat me with that thing? Hold on, 
Kinsey can figure it out. I literally have the world at my fingertips. Little vague, man. Gotta do better. You tell me the name of a company, and it becomes the property of the saints. You get your empire back, and I get to walk away. Kid, now we're talking. What are these? They're back doors into company records. One door leads to a weapons manufacturer, giving you discounts on weapon upgrades. And the other? An automotive parts distribution house. They'll discount work done on your cars. Pick one and I'll get you set up as a high-priority client, I swear! I really wish you'd reconsider, Maddie. These hands of mine were meant to rend bone, not hunt and peck on a keyboard. Well, well if typing's the issue, I can recommend some good voice recognition software. I, I know the best... Shh. You stuck with me when I rose from Philippe's ashes like a phoenix. You and me, we've bonded. 
That's lovely, but I feel it's time for me to move on. To, to, to be honest, I'm a little scared of, well, dying. I do run a demanding workplace. Maddie, I appreciate how you shared your concerns. I mean, the way Viola and Kiki handled their uh, departures made me just want to kill someone, you know? Oh, absolutely. Well, I've got a flight to catch, so... Maddie. Oh, God. Feel free to list me as a reference anytime. <laughs>